we shouldn't be looking at me and saying, you know, those derogatory remarks. I should be debating you right now on, on health care, even the Senate, on anything. That's what we should be talking about here. We shouldn't be, I shouldn't have to respond to those types of comments. And I'm so glad that this debate came up because if it convinces one woman in your audience tonight to run and to seek public discourse in a respectful way, I will promise them this. I may not agree with you. I may not like your position, but I will give you the due respect that you deserve because you put your name on a ballot and you work to get there. There's times when I'm like, maybe I shouldn't use Twitter because it's this constant barrage of um, just vitriol, right? And I know that there's people that use it to get into my head and you put it aside because it's a great tool to communicate. But it was sort of the straw that broke the camel's back. It's like, really, this is where we're at? This is how we're communicating to women? I, I just, I, 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 I can't accept that and I won't.